you're one of my returning friends, welcome back. But if you're new here, my name is Katie, and today I'm showing you how I cable manage my desk and office setup. As you probably saw from the preview, I have a standing desk, so this made this a little more challenging for cable managing. Also, I work off my laptop and my PC, so I had to accommodate the cables for both these different types of setups. So while this was a challenging project for me, I think it turned out great and I am in love with the results. So let's jump into it. First, let's walk through the before. As you can see, my desk is overloaded with cables and the floor looks super messy. Also, all the hanging cables underneath was such an eyesore. So let's clean up my desk and get everything moved off. I wanted to start this project with a clean slate, so I figured it was just easiest to move everything off. Before we start organizing, let's dive into everything I use to achieve this setup. First, zip ties for bundling little cables together, and Velcro ties for bundling bigger cables together. These cable clips help prevent loose cords from dangling around. I primarily use the clips with the three slots, the single slot, and the double slots. The biggest game changers on this list are these cable runners I got in a set of two to go underneath my desk. If you know me, you know command strips are my best friend. And last I use this surge protector. So let's get to work. To get started, I had to set up my two new monitors on this dual mount. Next, I installed my two cable runners with the opening facing the back of the desk. I did it this way so when you're sitting at your desk, you can't see the cables peeking through the runners. In order to connect my monitors to my laptop, I use USB-C cables into the ports. Majority of the time, these are in use, but when they are not, I wrap them around the back bar in order to hide them from the view. In order to keep these cables wound nice and tight when not in use, I added these cable clips to the back bar. I know this doesn't look that great from the back, but from the front, you can't see a thing. Next, let's add my surge protector to the bottom of the desk by attaching command strips to the back of the surge protector. I held it for about 10 seconds to make sure it attached well and used Velcro ties to bind the bigger cables together. Then I plugged everything in. So you ready to see the turnout? This cable managing project turned out so well because I can still raise and lower my desk with ease and then just move over the surge protector cable when not in use. Well, that's how I did it. If you liked this video, I'm posting all kinds of DIYs and projects on my TikTok, so you should definitely go check them out if you're interested. As always, you can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and Pinterest. And of course, I'd love to see you back here on YouTube. I check my comments very regularly, so if you have a question, drop it in the comments so I can answer it for you. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.